<laughs> I have lots of embarrassing stories. I don't know if, <laughs> if, I, if I should tell one of them here. <laughs> My name is Morten Hoffman Christensen, uh, and I'm a director at Cobrain, and I also am the owner. <laughs> as, of, as of now, I do a lot of work. <laughs> Uh, but in my spare time, I'll, I have a passion for wine and champagne in particular. Uh, so I enjoy that with friends. And also I play a little bit of guitar. One of my favorite restaurants in Aarhus, where Cobra is situated, is called uh, Domestic. And uh, it's a Michelin star restaurant and it's awesome. Recommended in 2019 for this, uh, in December. I went there with a few friends and we got a uh, we got a pretty good meal. <laughs> I've always, I've always had an interest for wine since I was a child. My my, my mother actually imported wine when I was a child from Hungary. <laughs> that was that was uh, the big deal back then. Uh, so I've always had an interest. Both, both my, my mother and my father, both of them had an interest for wine as well. So. You can say uh, I got it from my parents. So back in 2006, I didn't know what to do. Actually, I started an education called Multimedia Design. And then I started my own company back in 2007, uh, where we made home pages and all these sort of things and graphical design and, and films and all these sort of things. So, but uh, the financial crisis was lurking in the background and back then, so it didn't go too well. <laughs> so then I got a job at, at, uh, at this firm called Team Intercom, who made uh, digital signage. Um, and then I worked there. And the project manager at Team Intercom actually uh, recommended that I took an engineering degree, where I met the other founders of CoBreed. And, uh, and that's pretty much the story. The idea for CoBreed itself actually started out when we were studying for, 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 to become engineers. And uh, we got in business with a with a guy, and and uh, while while that was happening, soon and Alexander actually ended up taking uh, uh, another degree, a half a year of a business engineering degree. We were we, when we were finished with our studies, and, and while while they did that, they came up with the idea for Cobridge. Uh, while I was working with something else, the idea behind it was that he should be the investor at Cobridge, but it didn't go that way. So, <laughs> so, uh, so the idea there was to actually, actually help uh, the production industry, help them measure the data. But found out that the production in industry can be a, a heavy dance partner. So we started looking on the, uh, looking for uh, for other segments. Yeah, and that's pretty much how Cobrate began. <laughs> I have lots of embarrassing stories. I don't know if, <laughs> if, I, if I should tell one of them here. <laughs> Not, nothing that's appropriate. <laughs> one of the, my favorite projects I've been, is, is the one I'm working on right now, actually, for Cobrate. Because uh, I'm, 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 I'm actually working to get our entire infrastructure into a Kubernetes cluster. So that's really exciting. Mm. Yeah, I think that's good. <laughs>